。过去十二年，全球人口增加咗十亿，达到七十亿。七十亿到底系几多呢？如果一二三咁数，数到七十亿就要用二百年嘅时间。走七十亿步可以围绕地球一百三十三圈。咁七十亿人一齐住喺地球，到底又系点呢？科学界用生态足迹嘅概念嚟计算人类生存所需要嘅资源，即系维持一个人、一个国家，又或者系全人类嘅生活所需要嘅资源，以及会排放嘅废物，需要几大面积嘅有生产能力嘅土地。按照呢个标准计算，香港早就逼爆。In Hong Kong, everybody needs about four hectares of land and of sea to produce the renewable natural resources that we need. So that's four hectares per person. But if you look at all the resources in the world that can be produced sustainably in a year, divide it by the number of people on the planet, it's only about 1.8 hectares. So in Hong Kong, we're using about 2.2 times what is available per person on the planet. So if everybody lived like we did in Hong Kong, we'd need about 2.2 planets to produce that. 可以開發嘅土地越嚟越少，人口增長步伐就越嚟越快，資源分配嘅問題勢必影響全人類。Every person that you add onto the planet means less and less resources available per person. You've got a lot of countries that are developing; they're using more resources. China is a very obvious example. So we have a big disconnect. Um, and a growing population certainly makes the problem worse. 聯合國今年五月公布嘅世界人口趨勢估計，全球人口喺二零五零年將會達到九十三億，甚至係破百億，遠遠高於地球嘅負荷能力。世界自然基金會就警告，如果大家仲係維持而家嘅消耗水平，真係多幾個地球都未必夠用，未來可能真係要搬到外星居住先得啦。香港寬頻電視記者黃嘉莉報道。